you that probably the only reason you're here is that you're capable of being exterior because all innies are barred out. <laughs> you know what an innie is? Someone that's in the skull. But you can be exterior. Now it's very uncomfortable being someone around who is in their skull because guess what? They are, they don't like you being an Audi. So they'll try and put you in. How do you put somebody in? You introspect them. You ask them questions that make them look inward. But they make wrong questions. They're negative questions. Like, why do you do things wrong all the time? <laughs> you know? How come you're looking so old today? <laughs> yeah. Little friendly, little questions you go, boom. <laughs> yeah. Boy, you're putting on weight. You're looking a bit haggard today, you know? You're not sleeping? What's wrong? Off you go self-listing. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? That causes you... What happened to your space? What happened to your time? What happened to your energy? What direction your energy go in? What happens to your ability to manifest? Now, the interesting thing, if you want to create space, and this, I'm, I'm giving you some tremendous power here. I mean, this tool's been around for a while, but I saw no, no, none of you even observed it. Right? You just put the tool in the space. Now the person will go through all sorts of different things. Well, I don't know about that. I don't know about this, and so on, whatever it is. You know. We probably should have the definitions of the d three zones there somewhere, either on the back. Very quick one. Yeah. But see, there's such a simple formula for success. Do what you love to do. Be what you love to be. Right. So part of the problem is find what you love to do. Okay. Then be good at it. Be not just good, great. It's not a matter of going to find clients.